Hey, what's up, Justin? Hey, man. Do you, uh, I sent you that, that, that email through eBay. Do you want insurance? Do you want me to just send it, uh, send it as is? Because now, I mean, I'm going to send you 24 teams tomorrow in one package. Do you want insurance on that? So guys, a new case of Diamond Kings. Okay, cool. Um, send. dollars uh, to OBOG card breaks at Gmail. Okay, send twenty dollars to OBG. Yep, send it there and just and uh, do it as friends and family. Okay, and uh, I'll get that get that out to you tomorrow. Thousand insured, and yeah, cool. Especially with the, like expensive cards. I mean, it's not required for any. Oh, it's actually, my bad. Put this whole thing up. Um. I mean, it's not required for anyone ever to get insurance with cards, but I mean, I feel a lot better when people do get them, though. Um, holy Moses. Forgot this came. This comes in two twelves. Get this out of the way. Okay. Go. There's this. This is going to be 12. Okay. There we go. There we go. So we're going to have. I mean, plus when people, I mean, when you guys, when you guys get like really good hits that, you know, like $500,000 or more, whatever it is, I mean, you're definitely protecting your investments too. Because the post office could be unpredictable at times, as we know. All right. We've got three stacks of four here. We're going to go one through, um, <clears throat> no, one through two, three and four, five and six on the right. Uh, that's a dice. That's a one. First stack. I think we're back, back breaking on um, uh, Tuesday. I'm taking tomorrow off. I mean, it, it'd be like the worst, man. To get like a, a, a giant hit, and then the post office loses it. And then all I can give you is just a refund back, you know, a refund of your purchase. And that would just stink. All right. Get my gloves on, guys. We're going to get this thing going. This is a new... New caser, as you saw, and OBOG car brakes. This is break number four. Good luck, everyone. Let's go. We got a uh, new case of Bowman. That starts next. Oh, you have Justin. There you go. Yeah. Yup. I mean, it stinks just losing like a twenty-dollar package. 
right? And, you know, it's happened, you know, I mean, we've gone through thousands and thousands of packages. And it has happened, I don't know, maybe like six times. We're talking about probably, like, God, six, seven, eight thousand packages that we've actually had. It's been lost and we've had to, you know, refund the buyer. But, um, man, it that stinks. I couldn't imagine losing like a thousand dollar card that w I, I would have to shove that post office pretty upset george brett for the kansas city royals uh, it's going out to justin to start things out hurricane and al kaline That Judge Gallery, Mount Castle, Stephen, the Reds, man. Reds. They totally uh, yeah. took us out, man. Took up my cubbies. Cubbies are in the cellar. All by them lonesome selves, man. Let's go with Luis Caposano for the San Diego Padres. Uh, out to Jesse C. Jesse. I think the Pirates are like a half game like up on us. So, I mean, we could totally get out of the cellar, but it doesn't really matter. I don't know. It's going to be a long season for the Cubs and all that. Actually, Chris Bryant's having a heck of a year for any of you guys that have been following. We've got something right here. I don't know what this is. I think we got something. Um, it's a pretty good first half of the year. It is a little something. It's Joey Gallo. That's going to be Artis uh, Pelé, and it's 67 on 99. I saw the little spark, the, this little, um, the little shimmer here. So I knew it was something. Going up to Texas and Brian S. So Kate, Chris Bryce having a great year. Um, he'll probably be gone by after the All-Star break. Barra Singer. Hey, Chris. Uh, car show was great. No Dubons. No Dubons. So we went to this this place. First time we've had a card show in our county. I, I can't, I don't know. It's been like, I don't know, maybe a couple of decades. I don't even know. Um, and it was pretty good. It was really busy. Let's go Monte Harrison. 66 out of 99. I think that's what it says. 63 out of 99 is what it is for Miami. And that's going out to Jesse. So there's no Dubons. I, I end up getting uh, there's a handful of cards that I wanted going into this going to the show. I end up getting my first Steph Curry uh, rookie PSA 10. Really happy with that. I it was it, it, you know it's, it's not like a huge one. Um, Panini. I think it's like like a fifteen hundred dollar card. And then. Um, I got a Zion green prism. I stuff in my best Zion at this point. I got a Bryce Harper PSA 10. Um, what else? A Jason Tatum, just hoops, PSA 10. And I got a Vlad Guerrero optic PSA 10 and a Westbrook, just Fleer. That was a 9.5. You know, a little cheapy, but this is rookie. There's some good stuff at this show, though, man. Uh, Clark Schmidt going out. What is that? Like a little smear on this. Um, going out to the Yankees. Let me see if I can show you that. I'm not sure what this is, this line going up. If you can see that on the camera. Uh, I don't know. It's like a, someone took an eraser mark or eraser and kind of did that. So that's going out to the Yankees and Anthony G when you see that card right there. Yeah, there was this. There was this one table, um, and uh, no joke. I don't know. I mean, since I've been going going to card shows in the last, you know, what, uh, three, four months, you know, I've been exposed to some people with some ridiculous cards, man. I mean, next level cards, um, just absolute next level. Saw this this one guy here. Must have had no lie. He probably had between. Ah, four to five hundred thousand dollars worth just of LeBron James rookie cards. Sandberg. 
insane. You know, he, he I mean, for one, he had the um, Top Chrome Refractor BGS 9.5. That's a nice little car there. He had so much EX 9.5. He had like, I don't know, 10 tops. He even had a first edition tops as well. Um, just tons of stuff, man. Chris, uh, Chris said hi. Hi, Chris. So the car show was cool. Uh, it's just actually kind of packed. That was the only thing. It, it was like a kind of a small room. So they're actually moving the venue to a larger facility next month, which of course, you know, I, I mean, I'll go every month. It's in Brevard County, man. It's like super easy. It's like 15 minutes for us. Um, so yeah, pretty good. Pretty good show. I didn't see any pool hosts because I've been hunting pool hosts, not a single pool host at the tar show. Um, that was super disappointing. Couldn't find him anywhere. And there was this Steph Curry uh, that I wanted. It was a Bowman. This rookie, of course. 9.5. Yeah, that's right. I'm, I'm a huge. I'm a huge basketball fan, but definitely a huge Steph Curry fan. And um, 9.5 Bowman. Um, he wanted 44, which is way too high, of course. So I got down all the way down. Nice, to, nice hit for Detroit to 3,200 for it. Let's go, Casey Mize. That's a nice card. Nine out of 25 for Detroit Tigers. Tigers and Marty. I said, man, nice little low number too. So got down to 32. I I think I would have paid three. You want to budge from 32, and this is the thing why I didn't go lower because the subgrades were a 9.5 9.5 a 10 right but a 9 I think a 9 on I think it was 9 on the I don't know if 9 was centering or corners I don't remember I think it's I think it was centering maybe so that's that's why I didn't buy it man look at that the one in my face the club yeah I couldn't find this guy at all today Patchy. That's box and one, guys. So, yeah, I, I mean, I, I must have, you know, when you go to these card shows, at least when, with me, you know, you make like, I don't know, 20 rotations throughout the room. Um, you know, you kind of just eyeball things, and then and then you start trying to, you know, make some deals. Um, and then I. This one guy that had like the you know half a million dollars of LeBron stuff had this Kobe Bryant EX uh, 2000, which is raw, but man, the car looked really good to me. But I know they're so hard to grade. Um, he wanted 1400. I got him down to like 11. I still didn't buy it though. I'm just they're so hard to grade, bro. I don't want to buy the buy a card for that amount of money. And then have it come back like a seven or something, you know. Roberto Alomar, Cleveland Indians, not a good place there, Mr. Alomar. Out to uh, Maris, not in a good place. Uh, the club Ichiro couldn't find him anywhere either. I do, I do have a couple Ichiros and a couple Pujols rookies. I just want more. saw a Mickey Mantle, uh, what was it, I think it's a PSA 6, uh, I want to say it was like 52 Bowman, maybe, I think I'm right, call those, uh, the guy wanted like 6 grand for it, super cool card man, I myself don't own any Mickey Mantles, uh, I've never had a Mickey Mantle in my entire life, I haven't really been a big vintage guy, um, but I, I'm becoming one. It's got Brooklyn Dodgers here. It's Carl Erskine or Erskine. Let's go Erskine. Uh, to uh, you, Justin. Is this how the guy really pitch? You actually bend down. I wonder if that's that's accurate. Otani. I saw Mike Trout, uh, what was it, you know, this Tops Update, which, you know, the pretty high population for the um, Tops Update ones. 
I think it was a 9.5. Guy wanted 28. I might. I don't think so. Uh, Moniac. Pretty happy with the Zion though. That's definitely my biggest Zion now. With the uh, it was a green prism. PSA ten. Let's go here. It's DJ uh, Nick Meadert. This is uh, Tim Anderson, Gimenez and Ott. Hey, Tatis hit another home run today. Tatis just seems to be like a home run hitting machine, man. He's got like eight homers. And he missed like what, a good week of the season already, too. Let's go with a Daz Cameron, also for Detroit. Tigers coming out on fire here. All right, Marty. Casey Mize and Daz Cameron. Congrats. Piazza Legacy. Uh, our hitting is Teddy Baseball. Barsho and Bob Gibson. I saw a Bob Gibson rookie too. Um, it was raw. It looked really good. Really good. Too good. Too good. You know what I'm saying? Uh, to me, it had been, it has to be altered. Just no way. And plus, I, you know, this is the same guy that had the uh, the Mickey Mantle, 52 Bowman. Uh, he had tons of graded cards. He has this very nice looking Bob Gibson. That's altered for sure, dude. Uh, William Contreras for the Atlanta Braves and Eddie K. Two and a happy dance. Yeah, man. Tiger's paying off, bro. <laughs> Tanner Oak. I think you want to, like, I don't know. I, I don't really recall the price because I, I know the card looked way too good, and there's just no way you own that Bob Gibson that you're not getting it graded. It, it just, it's just no way. So. Uh, it's, it's been trimmed or something for sure. Pete Alonzo, Joe Adele. I know your Giants busting them up, dude. What, Chris? Where are your Giants getting the offense from, man? Bryce Harper. I think the Phillies are going to lose. I picked up my first Bryce Harper rookie today too. I mean, it, not a huge one. It was a uh, top screaming PSA 10. So it was like a buck, you know, buck 70. Uh, Phillies, Justin. I said a small little Bryce Harper rookie, but that's my first one. Seems like the Giants pitching seems to be pretty good. But what are you guys going to... I mean, because Dubon's not hitting for you guys. Where's the... Where's the O, man? Who's your... I mean, Longoria? He can't... I don't think he's doing anything, is he? Is Buster Posey crushing it or something? Yeah, yeah, your, your pitch is looking good. I agree with that. How, how's Buster doing? So uh, Shane McClanahan, Tampa Bay Rays, debut Diamond Kings, out to Brian S. Rendon, there's that camera guy again. God, Nick Castellanos absolutely crushed us today, man. Jeez. I mean, our pitching is so bad, dude. Ricky Harrison Legacy. I 
I see to me, man, when you go to card shows, you know, and you know, this is just the way I'm I'm figuring it. You see these really nice vintage cards. I saw some nice Hendersons today too. I I can't imagine why no one would send those in to get graded. So I, I'm thinking alter, I'm thinking alteration all day long. Christian Javier, debut Diamond Kings, Houston Astros, and uh, Jameson. Pearson. I mean, we don't have to, you don't have to worry too much. I want to think of like modern cards and alteration, but this vintage cards for sure. I, mean, I saw a few Mike Trouts besides the one graded one, but other ones are really soft in the corners. Bomb base. Who is this guy? Kohei Arihara. Alright. Krilov. It's like a Reds hit coming up. It's going to be Tyler Stevenson. That's going to be 89 out of 99, I think. The glare kills me, man. Out to the right. That's Justin. It is. Nice, Justin. Get you on the board there, man. D.B. Garcia for the Yankees. The Yankees won again, man. Yankees now at 500. I mean, I don't think anyone thought the Yankees weren't going to be a uh, good team. I mean, they started out slow, but uh, yeah, that's they're 500 now. Legacy is Joe Wood. Go with uh, Monte Harrison for the Miami Marlins frame card. It's out to Jesse. Abreu, Betts, and Cronworth. Or 66 out of 68. I don't know what the heck it was, man. Let me see. No, it was an 89 out of 99. So I can see it once I get out of this light. <clears throat> light makes it all like shiny and everything for me. On my end. Johnny Bench. Utani. Hey, Chris, you know what? I have football. I'm breaking football in a couple of days, right? Patchy did have a hit today. Flip it out. Flip it out. Which one? Which one are you talking about, bro? Which card, Chris? Verlander, the club. Oh, okay, I got you. <laughs> True. Joey, oh, Chris? Who's got the Giants? Uh, Sean L. Joey Bart, 54 on 99. I think it was due for Chris to come through for the the Giants. I said, man. It's Casey Myers. Clemente. Gonna have your Mike Trout Gallery, Patchy, and Bobby Dalbeck. Did you guys see that uh, that Mike Trout collection on eBay? I think 
I think it's been up for like over a year. Some someone told me on uh seven hundred and twenty seven thousand dollars for this Mike Trout lot. I mean it's a nice lot, don't get me wrong. It's not seven hundred and twenty seven thousand dollars worth, but it's a really it's a heck of a lot. How's Joey Bart doing, Chris? Uh, it's going to be Tatis, Gallery, Marquez. Let's go shirt. What is that? Um, shirt and apostle for the Texas Rangers. Uh, it's going out to Brian. You see that too, right, Brian? I do not know what's up with that one either. It just it just looks like a, a smudge of some sort. Maybe you can use a cloth to wipe it wipe it off, maybe. Let's see what see what I'm talking about right there. I don't know. I mean, I mean, it could, it could be that simple. Steven? Tatis, Gimenez. Mr. Mike Schmidt Legacy. for the Marlins. Jazz Chisholm. A lot of hits from Miami. And Jesse. Nice. So, Mel Ott. Garcia and Grover Alexander. So, we have an autograph left, it looks like. Of course, we can still get the case hit, too. Sammy Sosa, the club. I actually saw a Sammy Sosa PSA 10 Leaf, 90 bucks. I, even, although I'm a Cubs fan, I wouldn't pay nine dollars for it for the Sammy Sosa. Not nine dollars. Well, I guess I could buy for nine bucks and flip that. I guess right. Uh, Joe Adele, nice card for the Angels. Justin. All right, I take that back. Yeah, I guess I would buy it for nine dollars. I think you could sell it for like maybe forty. So yeah. Base. For the Reds, we're gonna have uh, Jose Garcia framed and to Justin. Joey Gallo, Seaver, Speaker. I was talking to my wife after I left the show. You know what's weird about it? I mean, not weird, I guess, but it's just kind of the nature of the hobby. You know, you know, I don't see any, I see any Barry Bonds, Mark McGuire, Roger Clemens, you know, Palmero. I, like I said, I did see the one Sosa, but it's crazy the steroid guys how their their cars are just the the demand's not there, you know. Now, I mean, of course, you can sell stuff on eBay all day long, but like, but at car shows, I never see those cars, you know. Oh, he's in triple A? Okay. I 
I think this is going to be our autograph right there. So let's go, we'll finish off the break on that pack. So let's get, go through this one real quick. Ty Cobb. Let's go Cal Ripken, the club. Sixto. All right. Last hit of the break will go to... Oh my gosh, Detroit. Holy Moses. Casey Mize. Marty, you definitely picked a winner in this uh this this break. Two Casey Mize autographs. You also got the um uh Daz Cameron as well. Jeez. And Joey Bart to finish things off. Yeah, no, nah, I wasn't I wasn't bringing up like you know, I'm just saying, you know, because Barry Bonds, man, and Clemens, those guys, man, it's too bad that that whole mark is, like, dead for the most part, you know? That's all I'm saying. I know that's your boy. Uh, Garcia, Joe Adele, Postle, Harrison, Bryce Harper. Look at this guy, man. There's no way he pitched like that, right? Schmidt. George Brett. Uh, you definitely should, man. Detroit was absolutely in fuego, bro. Also got this number card over here. Joey Gallo is to uh, 99. Let's go with these uh, memorabilia cards here. We got Jet Marlins. Marlins seem to hit a lot in uh, Diamond Kings. Jazz Chisholm. Stevenson's going to be 99. Roberto Alomar. This guy's a, I mean, this guy's a fool, man. I don't know what to say. Monte Harrison's a 99. And the autographs. I mean, we, we, we're talking about three Detroit and one Giants, basically. Let's go and get this Giant guy out of the way. Joey Bart is our 99. And then we're going to have Casey Mize. That's not numbered. Daz Cameron. Not numbered. And then we do have Casey Mize. Number two. Nine out of 25. All right. I know you are, Chris. We always joke around about Barry Bonds, bro. It's all good, my man. It's all good. All right, guys. Bowman is up in about, I don't know, hour and a, yeah, hour 15 minutes. We'll do that.